like I do and read different books, but as for me in my house, we're going to serve the Lord. And that's why we got to get back to saints. That's why the enemy is sabotaging marriages. Because people are not willing to do what they need to do. They're learning everything from Dr. Phil and all the circular world yeah. things and, and this book and that book and this black novel and this, that, and the other. And Kevin Hart was teaching us. And now Steve Harvey got a show. I don't understand that. And he used to be a comedian. But now we're learning all these things from popular folk. Right. 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 And the Bible said we should heed to godly counsel. Yeah. So now we're going to trade godly counsel in with world counsel. Now it done mixed in. Yeah. Child, if he ain't making fifty thousand dollars a year, yeah. I just give him some once a month. Nah. Yeah. Oh, if she ain't doing this, I ain't gonna help her. And that's why marriages are deteriorating. Yeah. That's why some people can't get married yeah. because they got so much stuff and junk on the inside. Yeah. Yes, they got the poker too. Oh, yes, she is good looking. Yes, from head to toe, tough. But on the inside. Full of dead man's bones. And it has to come a point in your life. If you want to receive the rewards of your faith, you got to be willing to persevere. Get rid of a Shanae and Ant Tweaker and the rest of the Eagles and, and the rest of the Fat Packs and Big Daddy and Slap Foot and, the, and Bam Man and Jughead and Peter Brad and Corn Brad and the, I don't know the rest of the names. Get rid of all of them. You gotta get from around them. Second Corinthians six seventeen said, "Come out from amongst them and be ye separate. Be ye separate. I, I know they ride clean, but be ye separate. I know she keep her hair and her nails done, and her boyfriend sell dope, but I can't wear my hair. I can't look the way she look, but be ye separate. And when you begin to separate those that are single, all of a sudden you get married." But you got to come out of the house. You can't sit in the house because all you want to meet is a paper boy. I'm praying for a man. Lord, give me a man. No. You got to get out there. Even the man hella know how to get in the traffic pattern. He ain't got a house. He ain't got nothing. He ain't got, some of them ain't got nothing but a buggy. But they got enough sense to get in the traffic pattern. And if we get in the traffic patterns of the spirit. And if we start moving from Genesis to Revelation and taking our time. And every now and then we got to take Route 66. Yeah. Every now and then we got to park around Ma. Yeah. And begin to just let the scripture, yeah. the sunlight of the scripture reflect on your life. Yeah. Therefore your life will begin to unfold. Yeah. Therefore you begin to grow in stages. Yeah. Therefore you begin you begin, begin to see your prayer life grow. Yeah. Therefore you begin you begin yourself grow in the scripture. Yeah. So when you do meet a man, and when you do meet a woman, it's not all those about closing doors. Because you can close doors and be a killer. You can pay all the bills and be a, a psychopath killer. You can be a pedophile and pay all the bills. Drive a nice car and good credit. So sister, don't, don't, don't let material goods get your mind out of material goods. Want a man that a man got out of God's own heart. Go off the man that, that loved the Lord. Yeah, he may got this, that, and the other, but as long as he loved the Lord, you got something to work with. But if he don't love the Lord and he's got everything of the world, Get him off your Facebook page so you can quit sending you them late night messages. Child, you look good. You look good in that dress you wore Sunday night. You want to try to act like you go to church. <laughs> the rewards of your faith, it comes through your pressing through. That's why we can sit here and acknowledge this. Because in spite of what goes on in your lives, he's praying you through. He's leading you. He's the shepherd. All you got to do is follow the steps. Because the Bible said when the blessing flowed from Abram's beard, the oil, it flowed down unto the skirt, which is the skirt represents the church. So don't speak against the pastor. Don't go behind his back and tell me, yeah, I gave him $50. No, no, no. Love your pastor. Pray him through. Because he got enemies that are coming left and right, yeah. side to side. Yeah. But he, like the woman with the issue of blood, I just got to keep pressing. She, she ain't worried about shaking Jesus' hand. She didn't worry about Jesus calling him on the telephone. She said, I, if I could just touch, just, just to heal, I believe in my time. I ain't got to grab his ankles if I could just touch. Just, just, just to heal. Just to heal. Do, do, do you, can you imagine what the heal of his garment? It's just, just, just a, just a bottom. Just a bottom part. The, the, just a bottom part. I'll be 
remain home. And if some of us, if we start pressing those that want to go to school, and those that, you know, you may want to lose weight, do what you have to do, saints. It's time. Because the world is coming to the end. Gaze is on the rise. We in a world now where anything goes. Drop it hot like it's hot. Do what you want to do. On Craigslist, they explicitly all types of uh, sexual material. People taking pictures of themselves with phone numbers. I was knocked off my feet with somebody showed me. Because I was like, I didn't know Craigslist had that. My God, the world is coming to us. And the enemy is trying to destroy us. And even though we put out all our hope in the president, but I hate to rain on your parade. He ain't for us neither. Right. And I'm closing on this note. How you know preacher? Because what he said in his uh, address, he said, I'm in place to take care of middle class America. And America shouted and we danced and we hopped. And the, and the spirit spoke to me and said, son, look it up. And I went to my, my, my laptop. Because I want to know what they're talking about. You know, in political, they use all types of terms. And I say, what mean by middle class America. Yeah. It means every woman that's making 40000 and above is considered middle class America. Every man that's making $50,000 and above is considered middle class America. Then they say, what about the poor? He didn't say a word. Then everybody got mad at the other one because he said, let the state take care of the poor, which is true. Because that is a local government thing that they take care of. Just like the uh, governor of Florida rejected the unemployment. Yes. They had the money, but he rejected That's right. yes. Your governor. That's right. Yes. So now I tell you, don't just pray, but watch. Watch. Just because he black don't think Satan can't use it. Oh, help me, Holy Ghost. That's why we got to learn to see past the color. The other color was used more as a tool for Satan throughout society through slavery and this, that, and the other. But now it's a hidden agenda because some of the things that went on while we got this other president, we would have never imagined that the devil would have came in a blue dress. Yeah. So I implore you, whatever you're trying to do in life, from this. And you will receive the reward of your faith. Let us stand. Oh